Time is running out. If you want to cast your ballot early in South Carolina, there are three days left before the end of early voting. Our Jason Rabin tells you how things have gone so far. According to data from the State Election Commission, about 13% of registered voters here in South Carolina have cast their ballots early already. Almost 50,000 people alone Wednesday across the state voted. Now in total, so far, 430,000 South Carolinians have voted early. Now Wednesday night, the leading candidates for state superintendent made one final pitch to South Carolina voters. If you really want to move students, particularly starting at the third grade, you've got to make sure that you have high quality teachers in the classroom and that you've got small class sizes in the K through three. Early literacy is absolutely critical and will be my number one academic priority as state superintendent. We have got to get back to teaching the proven science of reading. And we also know that in, do in class, high dose tutoring is also very helpful. Now, this debate happened in the middle of the second week of early voting. Now, that two week period runs through this Saturday. And the State Election Commission believes that pre election day turnout will continue to rise significantly. County election officials say they are happy to see voters take advantage of this no excuse early voting period. I think it definitely shows that voters like to cast their ballot ahead of election day. Uh, in Charleston, we've had zero lines, but yet record turnouts. Uh, we're able to deploy more resources to early voting centers than we can on election day. The data from the State Election Commission shows in 2018, about 1.7 million South Carolinians, or about half of the registered voters at that time, participated in that general election. And if you can't vote early, you can still cast your ballot on election day. In Columbia, Jason Raven, 7 News. For a list of early voting locations in your county, head to our website, WSPA.com.